Are you ready to hit the tracks with the crew motor first? Let's get into it! What's up, YouTube? This is Zebra Guy, or my however you want to know me as. We have something new. And we are doing this all thanks to Ubisoft. We have partnered, I've, well, I've partnered with Ubisoft to bring you this content, which is awesome. So, yes, this is a peek at season three of the Crew Motor Fest. This is all new to my channel. I'm excited. I hope you're excited. I'm going to tell you hands down, I'm not that good at racing games because if you've seen through my channel, I am not exactly that brilliant <laughs> at racing games, but we do try. So that's all fun. We enjoy that anyway. But yeah, the Crew Motor Fest. Our first bit of Ubisoft on the channel. Hopefully not the last. So before we do check this out and everything it has to offer, I want to say a massive thank you to Ubisoft for giving me access to the game. So yeah. um. Let's go check it out. Let's see what we can do. I've never played the game, so this is new for the channel. Give me a second. You also need to um hear some um stuff. So there we go. You could argue be able to hear things. So this is all the new stuff. So we've got new playlist. You can access the other menus here. All right. So we've got the shop. Okay. That looks fantastic. I'm not going to lie. Um, Vehicle catalog. Let's have a look what's about. Ah, oh, it's a Dodge Charger. Now, do you know what they need? Now, I'm a fan of a certain paranormally show. The people drive. A Impala. And um let me just give you this a second because we did forget to do something. There we go. But yeah, these people driving Impala. And that is something I would love to see in a game. What we got? We got Akura. We got Ariel. So we've got the Austin Martin DB5, which is new for this season. The 2022 DBS, which looks freaking fantastic. I'm not even gonna lie about that one. We've got the Audis. We have an aeroplane. Okay. Might figure out how to do that in a bit. So we've got some Bentleys. That's nice. I'm not even a petrol head. I'm I'm not. I'm not even a petrol head here. We've got the Bugattis. But my other half would absolutely die to check this out. Like I think it looks fantastic. We are looking in the garage. What we need, and I hopefully they'll they'll put this in. Oh, we've got the DeLorean. We want an Impala. Now a certain fan base would jump into this game. We've got the Dodge. The Bugatti. We've got airplanes. Fender. More planes, more planes, motorbikes, that's cool. More planes, more bikes. There are loads in this garage, wow. Infinity, yeah. Oh, the ivory tower. Now, I know this is 
It does look fantastic. This is a Ubisoft Ivory Tower. Might give that a try. Good cheap ball. Pone's egg. For someone that doesn't know cars or drive cars, because you know, being disabled, I can't drive, so. Maserati. Mercedes. Right, there's a lot. There's a lot in the garage. I, I'm not even going to lie there. What did we just do? All I did was exit the garage. Alright, here we go. We've got the playlist, we've got main stage. I actually kind of look like Mother Half. It kind of looks like Joanna. What we got over here? We've got the custom show. Welcome to the custom show. Here you can vote for your favorite vehicles of the week. Or register your customized ride to, no, the I like that because to get rewards based I like a bit on your of pink. ranking. Oh, we can run. Alright, so let's have a look what else is this. We've got the 80 on the main stage. Let's have a look at this. We've got the live competitions. We've got ah uh, here we go. This is new. What's up? I'm Rick Martinez. This is absolutely new here. We've got oh grid. But we have the Hollywood. What's up? I'm Rick Martinez. You know what? And I'm here. I think we should um We should give it a check. Let's go let's check the game out. Like I have never played um Motorfest. I want to. I want to do a race. I want to. Oh, there we go. A playlist is available. What a mini. Driver. So you know, tap. Cars are much more for a mini. Just vehicles. And Probably not many people world, know what that no means. Cause, 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 you know. Heck yeah. Like I said, I can't drive, but we are just going to mess around and have a look at this. Alright, this road is smooth. This Mini actually drives really good, apart from that. There we go. I like that. Right, um... Right. Follow the yellow. There we go. I knew what we were doing. Ish. So yeah, we have a bunch of new cars in this season. Which is fantastic. We've got the new Hollywood. Ah! We almost crashed into that person. So the Hollywood playlist, which is what we're now checking out. Slalom gate. I'm sorry, but Minnie, you can't drive very well. <laughs> As you can tell, guys, I can't play racing games to save my life, but we still have fun. We are playing Slalom Gate. We're going to crash into that one. Nope. Not going to. I did not get enough points. Like it told me to retry again. What I want, no, you know what I want? I want to try a new car. Vehicles. Right, let's see what we've got. We have a Mini. 
but we don't want to use the mini. What have we got here? Oh. Now, I love the uh, Firebird. One of my favorite cars. Yes, we are driving that. All right, okay. Yeah, yeah, we know there's quite a lot nearby. Would have been a good turn. Ish. Ah, there, there we go, there's handbrake. Yes. We did well. We did, guys. We did amazing here. So I remember back in the day playing the first uh, crew game. Absolutely enjoyed it. And, um, I was stoked about trying this one out. Like I said, I'm, I'm not the biggest um, racer player, I'm not, I will put my hand in my heart there and say that my knowledge on racing games is minimal, Sounds but like we're going all Hollywood for this new we do enjoy it, Most that's the problem, a movie, and they're offering you we do the enjoy having fun, and I'm playing this on the PC. So, I have a medium set up, so it's not going to give me the graphics all out, but my setup actually still does quite well. Ooh. The game is fantastic. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go back onto this. We're just going to leave that there for now. There's a lot of things on the map. That's fantastic. Um, let's get back to the shop so we can actually um have a proper look at what we um what's available. I think what it's going to be is going to be easier to um, show everything and just have some fun. So like we said, we had the Dodge Charger and the Lamborghini. They look fantastic. We've got the Accura. The Accura? The Accura. Yeah, I think that's what it is. So this is new. This is the um, DB5. I'm not going to lie, it does look fantastic. We do have the DBS. Which is another awesome looking car. Yeah, this is from the year one pass. So let's have a look at this. Okay. Two hundred eighty-six brake horsepower. That's not too bad. Acceleration seven point five though. That's where you got your, your speed. Four point two. This is what I'm interested in. A freaking aeroplane. Cadillac. Now I. In the town that I live in, there is a guy that actually drives around. In a kind of like this, the El Dorado. Now I live in a small beach town, so seeing this is fantastic. We got a Corvette. Chevy lifestyle, not Corvette. Camaro. Oh, it's a ghost. Got the Camaro SS. That's not bad. 
All right, so there's no acceleration data on this car. Okay. That's nice. What, they still need to bring? So, you know, I am putting it out there, guys. Need an Impala. Oh, there is. All right. Should have used my brains and looked here first, but there's, there it is. Actually looks like the one. You know what? I think we should purchase that. Let's, um... Got plenty of credit. We're gonna go with with this one. So now we have the Impala. Now what I wanna do is give that a drive. You're about to meet our movie director. He'll pitch you the whole thing. It looks fantastic. A bit of slow on the tape, but we'll take it. I don't know where we're going. All I know is that we're following the yellow line. I think we're going to go to Hollywood Action. That's where I want to go. Oh, I do apologize for um, crashing the Impala. All right, here we go. I'm Rick Martinez, filmmaker, action designer, visionary. They call me the wild child of Hollywood. And you want to babysitter, Rick? What? <laughs> My movies are world-renowned pieces of action. Wheel Force, Gas Attic, Crash to Survive. And I'm here in Hawaii with my new Motorfest buds to shoot my next project, High Ride. All right. Cars are everything in this movie. And you get to be my lead stunt driver. So get ready for some next level stuff because you're about to enter the Marty-verse. I don't know what we're going to do, but this looks fantastic. Oh. That's the ivory tower. See you on set, driver. This is Hollywood. Action! That's brilliant. I think what we're going to do, we're going to check that out. Ready for some on-set action? First event available. Let's get to it. We've got plenty of belt. Four feet to unlock. Nice. Five photo ops. And fast travel to container. Alright. in line. We are going to drive. We are going to go for it. Today, you're not just a driver, you're an actor too. In a movie produced by the Motorfest, driving a car is as much a part of acting as delivering a line. All right. Your first co-star will be the 1968 Austin Mini Cooper. Selected by our in-house mechanic and car consultant, Kaya Kana. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to do this. We're going to change our vehicle because they want us to drive this. That's a little beastie. For a 
Mini, that does sound BC. Rick will tell you everything you need to know about the scene. Good luck out there. All right, here we go. Let's check this out. New to Motor Fest. This is season three. This is the Hollywood. All right. Drive on the video lane to obtain bonus time. Do not let the timer reach zero. Follow the lane to do your best time. All right. Here we go. World Fest is two minutes, 22 seconds. I ain't beating that. We can try because that's a toxic trait. We can try. Direct this mobile. Rick Wait, can, you, can you move that camera to the right? No, a little bit more to the right. All right, we're behind schedule, people. Let's move it. Let's move it. Hey, hey, you. You're finally here. Welcome to set. Hey, listen, no time for chit chat. We're starting to shoot right now. And you're my main driver. You know that, right? Can someone bring the drivers to their cars, please? Thank you. So. Basically, you're Terry Jones, the main character, and this first scene puts the viewer right in the middle of your busy everyday life. I want you to get in your car. I'm going to give you directions as we go. They say you drive like freaking baby driver. That better be true, my friend. Listen, the I can't drive like anything. On her way. She's going to catch up with us. But well, we're going to have fun trying it anyway. Wait. Come on, everyone. We're doing this. This is High Ride, scene one. Action. Drive like baby driver. Come on. I can drive people crazy, but I can't drive like baby driver. We can attempt it. All right, my friend, this is our first scene. So let's get one thing straight. Sure, your job here may be driving, but you still need to get into character. I want you to feel the scene. You hear me, champ? Time thief, you just robbed a pawn shop and you got a bunch of goons on your tail. Get yourself out of this mess and drive like you mean. This is really happening to you. Don't put me on the spot, please. Hurry. We're gonna take some pylons out while we're at it. That lane on the road is called the video lane. That's where we need you to drive to get the best shots. Every time you see one of those, you follow them. Don't think twice. I'll get a bit banged up, my dude. Everyday life, you're used to that stuff. I don't think I am. Well, tell me I am. Get on that lane right there, it's critical for the shot. Oh, yeah, this will look great on camera. All right. Fun. Hey guys, sorry I'm late. How's it going? Hey there, welcome to my set. Terry, this is our car consultant and mechanic, Miss Akana. Yeah, call me Kai Man. Come on, come on, come on. You've been since our little vintage garage experience. You made me you crash, play, guys. Right. Oh, why is there a bus in my lane? It's not a bus lane, it's a film lane. Jeez. So for this first scene, we got you an Austin Lee Cooper S. Maneuverable and lovely. This car is such a fun ride. Fun ride before the high ride. Have you tried driving a mini? Alright, that was good. That log got in the way, that was not my fault. Here comes the first big stunt. You're gonna lose these guys with this next move, Terry. I see what you're thinking. Okay, driver. Better gun it if you wanna make this work. Nice! With that move, Terry's out of the woods. Uh -huh. Just a few more 
four seconds and it's just took some brain cells to work there i forgot i could boost right that car got in my way but that was not my fault at all There we go. Three minutes twenty thirty nine. Still not the best. Not two minutes twenty two, but that was cool. Now I'm pretty sure everyone's gonna enjoy this. They're gonna have fun. Okay, we got ourselves some more kids. Oh, okay. We're gonna go back to free drive, but we're gonna do some more stunt stuff. Oh, let's get on to our next one. We got. So what we're gonna do? Well, we're gonna do that. We're gonna drive a different vehicle. Where's our Impala? There's our Impala. We're gonna drive. To our next scene. Nice work. So how does it feel to be the leading driver for a production like this? So there's a lot of things in season three. I hope you're getting into the character. Hollywood playlist is one of the newer bits. It's fantastic. You get like I said, you get be a stunt driver. That was the first race. I felt like it went good. For someone who hasn't played this game, I think it went good. I'm enjoying it. I'm loving the atmosphere of this game. Like, it's completely worth grabbing. While we're on this drive, I do want to thank Ubisoft for, um giving me access to this game and checking out season three everything was fantastic Hawaiian Island just living our best life there's a lot of things but like I said there's a lot of cars in this playlist oh, everything We're just going to cut across because that's just who we are. We're just going to drive across. There's multiple cars. There's everything. And I'm pretty sure you lot are going to absolutely the crew is already getting ready enjoy. For the and Kai got you your next killer partner. A You're going to enjoy this. Dodge Challenger. I don't want a Dodge Challenger. Another nope, go away. That is no stranger to movie sets. Oh, we're going to drive a Dodge Challenger next, are we? Okay. So what we're going to do, let's see if we do have a Dodge Challenger in our arsenal. Cobra. Do we have... Dodge Challenger. Ooh. A Shelby GT500. That's a really nice car. You know what? I'm pretty sure we'll get it when we get there. But we're going to drive the um, GT. Ooh. That's got some speed on it. I don't know what we just did there, but we just got ranked second. You're up, driver. Listen to your movie director, okay? Now go break a leg. 
No, I've already done that. Now, I'm not actually kidding. I broke my foot um, six months ago. And it's still broken. So, no, don't need to break a leg or a foot. That's what you can go. Alright, so we're doing another escape. I don't know what this escape is, but we're going to do it. We went right past our scene. Alright, here we go. This is the next one, so we're going to be in a dodge challenger. Alright, so while there's three minutes one, so I think we're going to get there. What do we need to do? Don't know. Let's do it. Vehicle loaned Dodge Challenger. Objective win the race. Oh jeez. Now they're asking for much from me. Alright, buddy. You've made quite the impression on these first shots, but we're gonna need to confirm it wasn't just a fluke. With this second scene, the plot is thickening. You got scouted by the local kingpin. Goes by the name of Big Johnny. He's got a job for you, and you're not gonna want to pass on this one, all right? The man asks you to show up at his country house to seal a deal. But first, he wants you to show him what you're worth with a little duel in the dirt. This is our turning point for our protagonist. His future will be decided today. We gotta feel this, you know what I mean? All right, we're going back, everyone. Got a race. Driver, you get back in the carry shoes, and you make my day. We got you the right set of wheels for the job. I ride. Are you sure? Team two. Because I've just been driving the GT500 and Impala. So they're the right cars for me. If I, although I don't drive, those are my cars. Alright, that looks good. Nice Dodge Challenger. Glad everything's in automatic because I can't do manual. Alrighty, so again, in this scene, things get real for Terry. You're facing Big Johnny's number one guy. Mikey the Maniac. Alright, but we're in mud. I can't drive in mud. The big boss is putting you to the test, and you don't want to miss out on this opportunity. You gotta beat that guy. This is exciting. I know, this is brilliant. I'm going for the long take here, my friend, so I want your focus all the way. I'll focus as much as I can. The guy in the black car knows how to drive, and I told him to go all out. I want this to feel real, so go for it. You've got your own directing style, don't you? Long shots, real feel, real pain. That's how Oscars are won. Okay, Leo. Hit point with miss. Okay. We're fine. We'll get the next hit point. Well, driver, if you want to please our friend Rick Scorsese here and make that No, nope, we need to awesome. go all the way back to get to that hit point. Right. That's right. Nope. There we go. That's better. We needed that checkpoint to get anywhere. We're gonna make it look more sensible that we're being chased. Challenger RT first generation from 1970. This car is a monster among oldies and it ain't afraid of anything. RT actually stands for road and track, so don't worry, it won't let you down. Are you I sure? I the nerdy car stuff, but what matters is, it's badass. That's why I picked it. You mean why I picked it? Whatever. Alright, we're looking, doing good. Watch that next turn. Your car may be versatile, but you still have to adapt your driving on dirt roads if you don't want to end up in a ditch. The we're ditch doing good, don't worry. The an option.
Still doing good. And you made up a little bit. It's a battle of guts between Terry and Mikey the Maniac, and the chance for Terry to reach new heights. Give me everything, and don't be scared of playing dirty. It's a brawl. Well, I'm far ahead, so... that down nice I think we're doing okay not no three minute one you see these Cause. massive cameras floating around these are for extra wide angle on a Rick Martinez set you go big or you go home yes let's go big or go home Good shot. I hope so. Hey man, I was looking you up online. It says your actual name is Clarence Baker. Wanna catch us up on this, Clarence? This is not. I mean, don't believe everything you read on the internet. Jeez. We better my way. Come on, come on. You almost crashed. Not doing too bad. It also says you're actually from Chattanooga. Really? Oh, come on! Ooh. No, we don't, we don't mess with someone's name. Come on. Come on, Terry. You're skilled and determined to nail this test. The job is yours for the taking. Seize it. I know, I know. I'm taking it, I'm taking it. There we go. That was fun. That's what I call a wonder. Mikey the maniac is gonna be so pissed. That was fantastic. We'll beat him by a good um good bit of space. Alright. More XP going. Not bad, not bad. That was pretty cool. Now we're back at the GT. I think maybe we'll do one more. So you guys can see what we got what's going on in this um continues and the next scene will be shot in downtown Honolulu. We almost messed up there. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Uh, this Hollywood playlist is actually really fun. You got to show up rested and warmed up, as you'll be riding bikes this time. I was gonna be riding bikes. Action-packed sequence. Don't be late. The whole movie depends on you. Don't put that on me. Uh-uh. I'm slow. Don't, don't you be telling me to hurry up. That was close. Oh, I'm gonna say that was skilled driving. I don't wanna play slalom. Now, I need to get back to my, um... Gosh darn it. I want a bike. I am gonna drive... Can I drive through there? No, I can't. If 
I'll go back that way. Um, let's have a look at the map. No, map. Where's the map? No. Oh yeah, map. All right, here we go. We're going there. Oh, can't we? There we go. We're going to check this out. Event difficulty. You seem to be flying through the missions without real opposition. Do you want to increase the difficulty in the challenge? No. No, I do not. Because we're here to check it out. So, yeah, we are going to check out the bikes next. And I think we'll leave that there for this peak at Season 3 on the Crew Motor Fest. Well, I'm going to run down what's going to be available. Can handle a bike, because in our next scene, that's all you're going to get. This and then is you're your gonna first have job for Big John. And you don't want to mess it up, okay? You're driving a dirt bike. Some guys with massive trucks are chasing I want to feel the stakes, and I want to feel that Terry plays that bike like I play the violin. I, uh, like he plays the violin. Well, what's the saying then? Never mind. You get on that bike, driver, and you give me a key to the old conservo that'll make Steve McQueen look like a little girl on a tricycle. What do you mean I can't say that? Screw this. This is High Ride, scene three. Let's go. All right, let's try this out. I'm not very good at riding on, on doing motorbikes on the game. So this is going to be entertaining. Probably for you a lot. See, we can do a wheelie. We're back at it. So again, this is your first gig for Big John. You just snatched a handful of stones from some Don't do that. Bookmakers, all right? are pissed and they're coming after you yeah you better uh -oh. get used to it it'll happen a lot in this one east londoners who are you really these guys got a business here and i like the way they talk the early folks have got the bloody doors off that's england my dude that's england kind of messed up there but that was fun So you gotta move fast and use the size of that bike to your advantage. You cannot get caught. You hear me, Terry? These guys aren't here to take you for tea. I'm get trying not to get caught. I'm trying to actually to race. Because you know. That was funny. My bike taking down a lamppost. How do we change the bike? Onto the roof, then take flight. Check that out. So you got a, a sort of a Japanese motocross and a uh dang. Okay, Ratchet, you're up. Yeah, looks like you're struggling here. So driver, you start with good old Yamaha right here for me, uh, which will get me through anything. Before switching to something more powerful, I'll tell you more about that one when we get there. That was close. I must find the war. How are you doing this? The bikes actually feel really good. Terry believes he's lost them, but he's wrong. This is back. Yep, here they are. We're doing good, we're doing good. Hmm. 
didn't know this was speed going on. Alright. Totally right. Jeez. As much as you can. Now this is, um... Kind of speedy. Nailed it? <laughs> I think I nailed it. Nailed that it. was just fun. That's right. Love that. It's going to look phenomenal. Critical shots ahead. Don't miss the lane. I tried not to hit that, but it happened. It happened. Alright, we've got a lot of traffic to get through. Alright, let's go! I see you're as handy with a bike as you are with a car driver. Not really, but we try. So we did the first three bits from the Hollywood playlist. It's fun. Six in the world. Okay. I'll take that. Yes, I will. All right. Back in the GT. We are going to leave it there. So give me a second while we um head back over to the other one. Right, there we go. That is the Crew Motor Fest Season 3. It's fantastic. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I have. I've enjoyed doing it. So before I carry on about what's going on and what you're going to be seeing in this season, Again, I'll say a massive thank you to Ubisoft for giving me access to this to be able to do a video for you guys. So yeah, this is what you're going to get. You do have the Hollywood Action Playlist, which we did just play there. We did play three of the parts from that. We've got a list of um, vehicles, so we're going to have the DBS, the DB5. We've got the Mini Cooper 8, uh, 68, which we were um, driving in. Got the Ivory Tower Asus. Got the Audi R8 Spider Motorfest Edition. Didn't check that out, but I'm going to check that out later. Uh, Porsche 911 Director's Cut, the Porsche 356 1948. The Porsche uh, 959 1986. The Porsche 911 Camaro RS 2.7. So that is some of the things to look forward to in Season 8. There is also a Showstopper 80s Classic. There's a load of good things. You've got your main stage stuff, which is from month one, two, and three. I'm pretty sure you guys are going to absolutely eat up season three of the Crew Motor Fest. I've really enjoyed it. It is fantastic. There's not really much I can say about it. I've never been a racing driver. Um, car game but this this was fantastic it it draws you in it does a lot of things to do and I'm pretty sure you lot will actually enjoy I'm pretty sure you lot will enjoy this uh, season as much as I've just been enjoying it so buckle up put your foot down to the to the floor go speeding around Go check out the Hollywood action playlist. It is fun. Like I said, we did just show the first three from the playlist. So you've got cars, you've got bikes, 
I'm pretty sure there's going to be airplanes in there somewhere. We didn't have, we didn't play planes because we didn't. So um, overall, game's fantastic. This season three is fantastic. You lot are going to absolutely have a load of fun playing this. So yeah, you guys are going to absolutely eat it up. Also, just so you guys know that Season 3 will mark the first free weekend for the Crew Motor Fest. So from the 14th at 6pm until the 17th, so Sunday end of the day, you can enjoy the game in full for four days. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I've enjoyed it. That's been fun. Thank you again to Ubisoft for letting me uh, check this out. So without all that being said, I've been Marty, all the Zebra Guy, however you want to know me as. Thank you for watching, and there'll be more videos coming soon.